and welcome to today's video and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Becca and one of the things I do is buy and resell toys. And today I have a haul video. So I think this is going to be like my biggest haul that I've ever done. I got all of this stuff from three different trips, two to the secondhand store and one car boot sale. You can see here I have a lot of Playmobil. I just want to show them quickly because... Uh, when I do the little more close-up, I've already sorted them into different little bags. So I'm just going to show you that real quick. Here you can see like all of the things just lying here on the table. You can see there's a mix of plushies, uh, figurines, dolls, a mix of old and new stuff. And in this video, I'm not going to show them one by one as thoroughly as I usually do because that would just take forever. So I'm going to do it at a little quicker play pace, but hopefully you can get a nice overview anyway. Because I could, didn't want to make this video like half an hour long because I think we would have gotten tired by that. I got this one which is from a book. I got some Beanie Babies. I got this horse right here which I thought was a slice short because it was so ma well made. But it turned out to not to be. But it's in decent like condition and it's a nice figurine. So I'm going to see what I do with that one. I got this little play school like butterfly which was super cute i got a winnie the pooh glass i got like this for a dollar i think it was in nice condition didn't have any markings except the disney one but it was so so cute i have a bunch of different disney figures and i'm not sure how i'm gonna sell these if i'm like gonna do like a bundle thing or if i'm gonna sell them one by one um, usually I sell them one by one, but it's been easier when it's like Winnie the Pooh characters, then you can sell them one by one. And some of these are like more sub characters, like the dwarfs from uh, Snow White and such. So I'm gonna see what I do with that. I got some Frozen figures in different size. I got these cars from the Cars movie, also a Disney Pixar movie, that were really cute. I got them for, I think, a dollar each, so that's nice. And here, again, is my Playmobil stuff. You can see I've sorted them into smaller bags uh, because I couldn't wait getting into it. And it was a lot of things going through them. It was so, so many animals and accessories and such. And also these two houses up top. I'm not sure how I'm going to do with those. Uh, because they're so bulky and you know not the most fun houses is one of those like carrying cages that opens up to a house those aren't as fun or detailed as some other houses uh, I got some small Winnie the Pooh plushies from McDonald's I remember g getting these when I was young and they're just super super cute and then I got some uh, Brio toys, which is a Swedish brand. They make wooden baby toys or toddler toys. And I got some of those. They are quite high priced, so I'm hoping that I can resell them for a good price, or at least a fair price. And to the side, you can see I have some Smurf figures. I got the class classic, like smaller hard plastic ones, and then I got these ones. I actually saw this in the secondhand store like a few weeks back, but then they were... Uh, at the higher price but I grabbed them now because it was just a dollar each so hopefully I'm gonna sell those pretty quick and here you can see like the the standard figures that I've been making for quite a long time now uh, so I got a few of those figures hopefully those will sell well too and yeah I got a lot of plushies I got these count legs count a lots I'm not sure, I don't remember what they were called. But I got this one with these fancy outfits, which I haven't seen before. Got a Monster Ink Sally plush. And I got one Monster Chi. And I know I said in my last video that I was going to stop buying these because I've been picking them up too much. But this one ended up being with... Anyway, uh, I got two uh, little monkey lost and I really, really love these. These were so, so cute. So you can see they both have their nappies and their bibs and the pacifier. And I got this blue one which I haven't seen uh, it's not as common as the other one that one has quite common colors so I uh, hopefully I can get some nice price for those I really like these I've been finding a lot of these I've been sell I've sold like three in the last two months and then I got some little pet shops I got this plushie and then some figures with some accessories and to the left you can see a little Hello Kitty case which has a lot of figures inside and it kind of open up both as a case and kind of looks like a house 
and Hello Kitty is quite popular so hopefully I can sell these easily. I know I've sold some of these figures before and they sold quite easily and quite well actually and there's a lot of figures in here so hopefully I can just do this like a little bundle and sell them off. I got this little doll which is from the 80s, I think it was called Matilda. It's super cute, I found it randomly in like a bag with other things. So, but it still had its shoes, so that was nice. Uh, again, like a little pet shop figure, this one wasn't one of the newer, so they are not quite as nice. Here are some Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from the latest Nickelodeon show. And uh, yeah, here I got some Monster High, which I've been selling every now and then, and they sell quite easily. It was a few years now that I sent they stopped making these, so hopefully the collector's market will pick it up. And I got some puzzles. I got this one, which is from the Disney store, and I got this one, which seemed to be a little older one, and it's a cube puzzle. So that one's like cute. I got some uh, trolls right here. I got this random watch, wristwatch for Disney Mickey Mouse one. Um, not sure what I'm gonna do with these. Uh, it's quite small size, and I really don't want to go and pay to get the like the battery change. But I'm just like, oh, it's gonna cost a lot of money. But I will see what I do with those. I got these Yuhu and Friends dolls not plushies and i'm not sure if any of you remember these they were popular super super popular like between eight and five years ago and i got a set of those i got a woody doll i got this uh, piggy bank money box with winnie the pooh it was super cute quite big and really nice also i got this one which was super super fun this is the play school mr potato head and this is like the old one the original one and it comes with this bucket and has i think it has almost all of the pieces i haven't really checked to <laughs> see how many pieces it's supposed to come with but you can see here it has a lot a lot of stuff so most of you will know like mr potato head from the toy story series and this is what they like took it from they do have the newer ones but they come in a clear uh, clear bucket so you can easily see which one are the older and which ones are the newer so that's my whole sale um, or here <laughs> whole haul uh, so a few of the things I've started selling already since I've had these like for a while I was supposed to post this video in the beginning of this week but my video edit program kind of gave me a hard time so I haven't been able to do this until now so hopefully it's gonna be okay. I'm gonna try to post another video on Sunday. So it's gonna be kind of a tight space in between, but hopefully that will be all right. Again, hope you like this video. As I said, it has a lot, a lot of toys and hopefully you got to see like most of it anyway. If you have any questions of any of these toys or such, just leave it down below. Otherwise, thank you for watching. If you wanna see more of my reselling videos, I will leave the link to the playlist in the description bar so you can check that out. If you wanna see my latest up uploads and such, please, please feel free to subscribe and yeah. Leave a comment if you have anything to say. Other than that, I just hope that you can take care and just have a lovely, lovely day. Bye!